Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. It is Friday today and I wanted to vlog throughout the whole weekend. So I'm getting ready to do my makeup. Erica is coming over. We are launching a new item for Shop Sienna Sky. So it's a lounge outfit and it is so cute and very, very comfortable. So we're launching that today on our site. We also are having a restock for maroon tie-dye shirts. Those we are getting next week. So definitely if you wanted a maroon tie-dye or pink tie-dye, be on the lookout because we are restocking those but today I'm wearing this new sweatshirt that I got from misguided and it's so cute it's blue and blue and tie-dye and it says mama on it and I got some other things from misguided too that are like more bump friendly because I don't have that many items um, so I'll show you guys that after too but for now I wanted to do my makeup and show you guys some new things so I got this package in the mail yesterday from it cosmetics I love this bag and I'm gonna bring it camping with me tomorrow it just says your skin but better and it's like the perfect size bag. It's actually pretty big. But I think this would carry makeup and skincare. So It Cosmetics came out with a new foundation and it's called your skin but better foundation plus skincare. And they sent over two different shades. So hopefully one of these shades works for me. So I have medium neutral 31.5, which looks like this. And then I have medium neutral 31. So we're gonna give it a try today. I also have some other things that I got from Clarins and Pat McGrath. And yeah, and then I'll show you guys my little haul. But these are the two shades. They look pretty similar. So they look pretty, pretty beigey. It says it improves bare skin in two weeks. I'm gonna try 31.5 but I am going to prime my skin with the Porefessional by Dr. Brandt. I feel like this fills and pours really well and makes your skin literally like a velvet. So this is one of my favorite primers. I just use a little bit and I try to do tapping motions. Also, sorry, the lighting is going in and out. It's a kind of a weird, wonky day. But just gonna blend this in. As you guys probably know from my post on Instagram and my last vlog, I got engaged, which that's crazy. I was kind of expecting it, to be honest. Um, I feel like Scott gave it away by telling me I need to put my nails on. Because I told him a while ago, I said, make sure my nails are done when you ask me, when you propose to me, because I don't want to be, like, without fake nails. I pick my nails and literally they bleed. So... That would have been a scene. All right, I'm gonna use 31.5 and hope that it's a good match and not too beigey. That looks pretty good. It's like really, really thin. I'm just gonna do half of my face so you guys can see the difference. It's actually a really, really good match. Okay, so that is what my skin looks like. Like I said, I know the lighting is a little bit weird, but that's like a really, really good match. And it's so thin, it's like very, very lightweight. I like that okay just gonna put it on the other side I think it looks really nice it looks very natural it's like a little hint of like a sheen but I'm liking this I'm just gonna do like my concealer and powder and then I will show you guys the couple new things that I All right, so I finished off the powders on my face did a blush bronzer highlight now I'm gonna go in Clarins was kind enough to send me two products. So I received this free for review from Clarins and Octoly. So the first item, look at how pretty this compact is. So this is the four ombre compact in number three, flame radiation. So this is so pretty for fall. This is what the inside looks like. It does come with a little sponge. I don't honestly use these, but I do like the presentation of it. But I'm just gonna pop this off. Look at how pretty these colors are for fall. Really, really pretty. 
So I'm gonna use these today. I'm gonna use it lightly though because I know this is more of like a deep look. I also have a brush here from Clarins, so I'll show you guys what this looks like. This is the eyeshadow brush. I guess that's just what it's called, eyeshadow brush. Okay, I can't get it off right now, but <laughs> that's what it looks like. It looks like it's gonna be like a small, more precise tapered blending brush. But for now, I'm just gonna use a different brush. So I'm gonna go in with that really pretty chocolatey brown color and put this in my crease. Okay, and then the only other shade that I'm gonna use today is this champagne glittery shade, and I'm just gonna use that all over the lid. Pretty. Okay, before I put mascara on, I always like to set my face just in case the mascara transfers. So this is from Clarins. This is the Fix Makeup Long Lasting Makeup Hold. It hydrates, refreshes, and soothes. Look at how fancy this bottle is. It kind of reminds me of like a perfume bottle. So I'm gonna spray it. It's a good mist. It has like a really nice light rose scent to it. Okay, now I'm just gonna do my mascara and then I'll show you guys my, okay, time for lips. I'm using my Buxom Lip Liner in Hush Hush. The tip kind of messed up, but it's fine. So I'm just gonna use this. I can hear Teddy starting to snore. Okay, so using that first. And then I am using Pat McGrath. This is the Lip Fetish Divine Lip Shine. Look at how pretty this packaging is. I love Pat McGrath packaging. And this is in the shade Nude Venus. So how pretty is this packaging? It is light pink and then it has the gold lips on it. And this is a really hydrating product. It definitely makes your lips shiny. I do already have like a chapstick on, but it's fine. Um, this is the color, a really pretty light nude. And I love it. So this is like the third time I'm wearing this. It's just, I love when my lips are comfortable and hydrating. So this is it. So I received this free for review from Pat McGrath and Octoly, and I'll link it down below. So that's what it looks like on my lips. I'll show you guys in different lighting too, cause like I said, it's weird, but really right. pretty. So I feel like the lighting is way better over here. This is my finished makeup of the day. I have lips, my eyes from Clarins. My skin looks really good, that IT Cosmetics. I really, really like it, I think. I'll have to see how it lasts throughout the day, but so far, just the way it looks on my skin, I do really like. So yeah, this is my makeup, and I'll show you guys my clothes that I got from Misguided now. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up from Misguided. So like I said, this sweatshirt is from Misguided. It's super long, so if you are pregnant, this would be a really good bump one. It's very oversized, and it's very long. So this is what it looks like. I did get the matching biker shorts. Now these I didn't know were actually gonna have like extra room for a bump. So they're a little bit big for me right now because I don't really have that much of a bump yet. Um, but they are super cute and I just love blue. I love wearing blue. So I think these are gonna be cute, but just a little bit too big right now. Um, I also got all of these. I do want to show you guys my outfit that we're launching for our boutique. So this is going to be on Shop Sienna Sky. Look at how pretty this color is. I'm obsessed with it. And it's like super, super comfortable. So by the time you guys see this, um, it should hopefully still be available. But it has a hood, so cozy. I would say this is like a loungewear to wear around the house. I would 100% wear it. Um, okay, moving on. 
So I got this from Misguided. And this is like, to me it kind of looks like a men's shirt, but I was picturing wearing it over like a tight dress, which I'll show you guys. And then this completely open. So it does say Misguided right here, but it's a really pretty sage color and I love the color sage too. So I just picked up this. And then to wear with it, I got this dress. Now, I haven't worn like a tight dress in a long time. So I'll probably definitely see the bump wearing a tight dress. I will try this on for you guys, but it's just a heathered gray tight bodycon long dress. And it just says misguided right there. So I pictured wearing this with that. And then I got this sweater really love this sweater it's just a lightweight white knit sweater and you can't even see my face right now this is what it looks like it's really pretty it's just plain and white but i really like it very cozy and i got the sweater to wear with this so it's a light pink dress and it's definitely tighter more form-fitting it looks like it's going to be a bit see-through but I thought to show off the bump with this and the sweater, I thought that would look really nice. So got that. And then the last thing I got is definitely like, like this doesn't even look like it'll fit my thigh to be honest, but it's very stretchy. So this is a turtleneck dress in a really pretty tan color. And it has like the ribbed detailing. I think this would be pretty for like, ooh, I think this would be pretty for like Thanksgiving maybe, depending on what I look like and depending on how it fits. So I got those. I'm gonna quickly try them on for you and show a little bump date. All right, so this is the gray dress. I feel like it looks good. I feel like my bump is definitely popping in this dress. And then this is the sage like button up over it. I think this looks really cute together. Look at this bump. That's a bump, right? Or am I just bloated in that? I don't know. I think it's a bump though. I'm pretty sure it is because I'm not usually on a normal day. I don't have this in the morning. I have this at night. So, wow, it's a bump. So this is what it looks like. I think it looks cute together. I like the gray and the sage. And yeah, this is probably, this is so comfortable. This is probably one of my favorite things that I got. Just like the combination of this. I feel like I look like George Washington. Um, yeah, I think this is so cute. Definitely obsessed with this outfit. Um, wearing the sweater over the pink dress. Now this dress is extremely see-through, so I'm not even gonna turn to the side, but I think the bump looks really cute in this. Um, I think I would have to get maybe like the Skims Maternity. Something like that would look good underneath here just because of how see-through this is. It's a very like thin material. Comfortable, but whoa, you can see everything so super cute for the bump definitely want more outfits like this for the fall and winter but maybe ones that are not see-through last outfit how cute is this i really really like this sorry if you can see my nipples um i think this is really nice this is definitely thicker material i think this would be i feel like i said this every time but this would be a good Thanksgiving outfit, depending on how large and in charge I am by then, but I really do like this. It's very long and stretchy and comfortable, so I really like tan. And my boobs are getting massively big, but I think this is so cute. Definitely like this one too. Goodness. All right, we just got back. We stopped at Bath and Body Works. Erica got six soaps. And then, oh, so oh, curious. <laughs> and then we got a matching shirt. Can you show them? Yeah. I won't show you, but. Okay, thank you. Welcome. <laughs> we both got a candle and soaps, and <gasps> good things happen to babes who hustle. So cute. Can't wait to wear it, and it's like super soft, too. So we both got that from Francesca's, and Francesca's was 40% off everything. Excuse you. No, 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 no. Um. I got wallflowers because I needed new fall ones. And I got this candle, white pumpkin. I don't I own this. I that too. Yeah? And I have some Can I see yours? 
Which one did you get? Oh, I got the leaves. Leaves, the best candle ever. Got, like in the most beautiful packaging. packaging. I love the lid too. Like, it's so pretty. So pretty. Oh, I like that a I lot. I know. I like this one too, but I like that packaging, and I like the lid. Yeah, you look good. So the candles were ten dollars off, and then I got a bunch of wallflowers for fall, and then someone, let me see. A sweet subscriber, so if you're watching this, thank you so much. This is from my baby registry, and this is from Alexis. So thank you, Alexis. You wanna see, Ted? I won't open up the whole thing right now, but this was on my registry. It's a muslin swaddle. Look at how cute that, oh, don't mind my missing nail. Look at how cute that color and pattern is. So thank you so much, that was very sweet of you. Can't wait. And then we also just got food. So Caesar salads, chicken wings. We got pumpkin ice cream. Yeah. Pumpkin ice cream on a fall day. Pumpkin pie. Yeah. I got Oreos on mine. Uh, Erica got a kitty. <laughs> <laughs> I got an extra large apparently. <laughs> medium. But it was like really yummy. I tried a little sample. So good. But we're going to eat this first. And then ice cream. Oh, and we got mac and cheese too. Yeah, this seems really tiny. Look at how tiny this is. It's okay, we can, we can always eat more toast. <laughs> okay, okay. Good morning, it is Saturday morning and we are going to Maine to go camping. So I have my things packed right there. Some sneakers, sweatpants, we're only going for one night. It's supposed to be like 79 for the daytime and then 54 for the night. So I think it'll be fine, but I brought sweatpants and sweatshirts anyway. And like a makeup bag, obviously. Ooh, I didn't bring skincare. I brought makeup wipes. That sucks. Um, I'm not gonna bring it though. It'll be fine, I'll do a mask tomorrow when I come back home. But yeah, this is what we're looking like. We got a bunch of different blankets, Scott's stuff. Scott literally brings more stuff than me, but it's great. So we have a four hour drive. Hopefully we can stop at Starbucks because that would make the drive a little bit more manageable. But yeah, going camping. So I'll try and vlog like maybe our camp setup or something because we're not gonna have service, so. I'll try and vlog as much as I can. All right, so we are camping and the leaves are starting to change. This is our tent, it's pretty massive. Hopefully that's not mouse poop. I don't think so, but pretty big tent. What is this, an eight person tent, babe? Yeah. Yeah, we like an eight person tent. We got a new air mattress. It's a cord, isn't it? Yeah. That stinks. Um, I'll show you guys the snacks we got. We also got this Febreze just to make everything smell a little bit better in the tent because I feel like old tents kind of smell a little musty, you know? But we brought snacks, Belveda utensils, Juicy Juice. Scott uses these for coffee. We've got Cheez-Its. We have Sweet Cajun Trail Mix. What else? Ooh, I don't know why, but I really wanted Jolly Ranchers. Well, I kind of know why, but. Oh, and we got these. <gasps> Reese's pumpkins? Wow, I got a stash of those. We can't put anything in the tent though that's like food, because there's bears. And babe got new glasses. He matches me. Mm -hmm. Except I don't have this little string. Little, little piece of string. <laughs> but it looks so nice. I wish I could drink something, but I'm not. It's Monday, and I am back home. Look at my outfit right now. What am I even wearing? I'm wearing Scott's sweatpants. This is the bump. This is the bump. I'm almost 16, I'll be 16 weeks tomorrow. So this is it from the front, and then from the side. But, um, yeah, I look a mess today and I've just been on the couch doing nothing. It's gloomy. I burned a candle and now I'm actually gonna reburn it because it smelled so good. This is the candle that I got the other day at Bath and Body Works with Erica. White pumpkin, Ooh, this is a good one. This smells like 
um, pumpkin, that pumpkin slice from Starbucks. But they have pumpkin bread warmed. That's what this smells like to me. Oh, it smells so good. So I'm actually gonna like this. I'm watching the home edit right now. If you guys wanna see a baby haul, because I got a bunch of cute outfits from like, friends, family, and I also ordered some really cute clothes. I also ripped my nails off. My ring looks real pretty, but I did rip my nails off. Um, so I'm gonna have to get, look at that bridge under there. It's a bridge of diamonds, I love it. It is a little bit big, but I know my fingers are gonna swell when I'm pregnant, so I'll worry about that after. I wanna start getting my nails done um, because I feel like I need to with a ring now. And I also want a pedicure, but I'm gonna burn this right now, so let me grab the lighter. This is like the perfect candle on a fall day or just like a cozy day in general. Obsessed with this, I might have to get more, but I think I'm gonna hold off on the candles until the candles sail. How cute is your face? I cannot, whoa, I'm falling. I cannot get over your face. Are you getting groomed this week? It's kind of sad because you look exactly like a teddy bear. Isn't that crazy? I always find him like the cutest right before I get him groomed and then I'm like, why am I getting him groomed? Because he looks like a little teddy bear. But he needs one more grooming before the winter, right? I think so. Okay, I'll play with you. I'll play with you. All right, so I think I'm gonna end my vlog now so I can have this up for you guys tonight. Ready? Catch. Good boy! Good job! You get so proud. Yay! That was so good! You wanna do it again? Sit, sit. Okay. He also stays really well. I'm gonna put this right here. Stay. Look at his little eyebrows. Okay, good boy. <laughs> You're so good, you really are. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I will see you all in my next one. Bye.